Hello everyone, welcome back to another full self-driving videos in New York and my name is Anato and I love to film Tesla full self-driving videos, especially in New York. Um, I'm currently a little sick, but still I love to film, so I would make a video about full self-driving performance in January. Uh, today is 8 January and we're going to see how Tesla FSD handles a uh, few things here we're gonna test unprotected left turn we're gonna also test narrow roads we're gonna also test a merging road where fsd always you see that uh hesitation uh you uh really don't know it was green light it didn't even change to green to red or anything but it just breaks suddenly and then change the lane because that truck is exposed a little bit to the outside uh track but unfortunately, I really don't know why there is a hesitation. It could just easily change the lane while, while there is no other vehicle on our left side. So I really, really don't know why. So we are proceeding as you can see, and we're gonna see how Tesla FSD merges here because on this upcoming stop sign, it is changing lane and move to the right side one more time while we need to stay in the left side because we're gonna merge from our left side let's find out how fsd handles the situation because we really need to stay on the left side because we're gonna merge and now it is changing the lane and now we need to change one more lane to do that so it turns on the indicator it breaks immediately a uh, little bit of hesitation definitely so there are traffic from the opposite side we shouldn't proceed very good after this car we can definitely proceed but it is still a stuck no it has started moving very good job very nicely done i thought because my in my last video the car got stuck there so i really thought like this time is gonna stuck again but this time it immediately proceed and passed that stop sign very good job uh, but the first moment when we started the video, there was a hesitation there. So I really don't know why. Also, I want to update you on something that is version 12.6 is coming. As Ashok said on X, the VP of Tesla AI said that they're going to release that 12.6 very soon. He said in one week, but that one week's already passed. But we didn't get anyone getting version 12.6 on our hardware 3 car on um, like until now but i really think they're gonna release it tonight this is my assumption i might be wrong but my feelings are saying that they're gonna release it tonight and also some model s and x are getting already get it like already they already got like version 12.6 and they're saying very good things about version 12.6 they're saying it's almost like version 13 so we have to wait and now we're gonna test that narrow road so let's do it guys so narrow road test number one this is a tree a like tricky narrow road i might have to say that because version 13 can handle it but version 12 always gets stuck and you can see the hesitation you see and now we're just completely rerouting us it was trying to make that left turn but it realized okay i already passed that certain uh like distance so i cannot make this left turn so it just passed that road and going through a different road right now there is no vehicle we can make this left turn and we are making it very good yeah so the first place my question is why can't you do that left turn in that exact road so we're gonna do it one more time let's do it guys so narrow test number two in new york the first time the car completely failed it navigate us through a different road but we're gonna see how the car handles this <coughs> time and let's find out and this time it could able to do it <coughs> very good job guys excuse me sorry about that uh yeah so it could do it definitely very nice job and this time less hesitation definitely has some steering wheel navigation like a steering wheel nag there but still the car could able to do it so i'll definitely give a point but whenever the car was making that left turn it was definitely going a little fast i don't like when there is a narrow road and you have to calculate the space you don't need to go that fast so now we're gonna do some unprotected left turn. This is also a tricky unprotected left where you need to 
uh, go straight, make your right turn, and immediately make a U-turn. So let's do it, guys. So unprotected left number one in New York. This is a tricky unprotected left. While the sun is directly hitting in the cameras, so definitely the camera have to fight with that. And then we're gonna stop. You see, it is saying take over immediately. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna engage it after a few moments. So I'm gonna engage it one more time. We're gonna stop on this stop sign, and then we're gonna creep to look on our left side, right over here. And if there is no vehicle, we're gonna go straight, make a right turn, and then immediately make a U-turn. So this is what the car is doing right now. It came in that lane perfectly, but you need to wait here. It shouldn't proceed, this is what I'm saying. It shouldn't proceed right now. Because there was vehicle on the opposite side. And also when there is vehicle, Tesla FSD normally doesn't make U-turn that fast. That means you need to wait, and when there is no vehicle or is so far, you can make this U-turn like this. And then I will count this as a pass. But the thing it did was there was vehicle on the opposite side, and the car wanted to proceed, which I really don't like. <clears throat> That's why I took over, and I will count this as a fail. So let's do it one more time, guys. So unprotected left number two in New York. Again, the sun is directly hitting in the camera. So hopefully it can see that. Um, and we're gonna find out again, the same thing happened. It just saying take over immediately. So I took over. Uh, I really don't know how Tesla FSD team will solve these issues. Again, it is saying it. So. I engage it one more time and this time there are vehicle on our left side so we need to stop there to look and when there is no one we can proceed but there is still vehicle no you shouldn't proceed now and now you can proceed and okay almost got it but again the same mistake it proceeded fast but I took over again because there are vehicle on our uh, behind so I had to take over and really don't like the idea that the car was about to go to the right lane where it needs to be, but the car just failed there and couldn't make it. The first time it came to the right lane, but when there was vehicle from the opposite side, the car tried to proceed, so I took over. But this time it didn't even come in this lane. It should just come over here, wait over there if there is no traffic we can just make that but unfortunately it couldn't do that so let's do it one more time guys unprotected left number three and hopefully this time the car will able to do that but before that definitely again the same thing happens i really don't know how tesla ai team will fix this issue but i'm gonna engage it one more time we're gonna stop on this stop sign we're gonna look on our left side there is a school bus right over here so let's find out how FSD, wow, it stopped. You shouldn't process it because there is a school bus. So I'm just gonna allow, uh, it is turning on the left indicator while we need to make a right turn, interesting. So there are kids and uh, we're gonna see how FSD handles because there is a school bus here. There are other traffic also here. So I'm gonna engage it now to see how FSD handles. It shouldn't process it. I, I really don't know why it is creepy. Okay, okay, yeah. So now we stop here. If there is no traffic on our left side after this car, definitely we can. It is going behind, behind. Very good, very, very good. Confusion. And now we are stuck here. This is completely new. Again, same thing. I really don't know what the car was thinking. It could just easily go behind that SUV and then make that U-turn, but it just came and waited on the right side. I allowed it to do it because there was no vehicle behind me. So I allowed it to do it, but really don't know why. It is completely a new thing for me because it never did it. Like. Like so many times there was vehicle on that lane, but the car either 
wait behind that vehicle or just pass that vehicle. But this is the first time I saw the car just waited beside it. So that's a very new thing for me, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Uh, probably learned something about FSD. And let me know in the comment what you think about this video. Please hit that subscribe button if you are watching this content for the first time. I love you so much. And hopefully I feel better. And thank you so much for watching, guys. And have a wonderful, wonderful day.